This video I want to talk about a lesson I learned the hard way in the real world. And that's when you have resources here like this BizTalk function library. So just to refresh your mind, this is just a regular uh, C sharp function library or a uh, class that I created. It's just a DLL that we put in the GAC. And if I were to add some new logic here or actually change a lot some logic and then rebuild it, the trick is that next time you build your MSI, it is not automatically re-included. So if I were to do right click here and say export MSI, to me any common sense natural thinking person would think that it would pick up all your current DLLs and it would uh, repopulate them, but that is not true. So if you go to resources here, go to your BizTalk function library, which is our C sharp DLL, you can't double click it, you have to right click modify. Then there's a the little refresh button. And even that is a bit of a pain because you have to click refresh and then oftentimes you'll be you know somewhere else on your disk here and by default it, it doesn't remember what library you were actually in. in this case it was actually there because I just uh, kind of practiced this demo a few minutes ago before I turned on the video so when you come here and click refresh you're gonna have to go to like my documents you're gonna have to save wherever on your disk your DLL is Visual Studio, Projects, BizTalk Intro, BizTalk Function, BizTalk Function, Bin, and then finally Debug, and finally the DLL. And so until you click Refresh and re-grab that DLL, it's going to keep including your old DLL in your MSIs. So what was ha happening to me was I would be uh, rebuilding my MSIs here, and I would get all my new orchestrations and stuff, but I w wasn't getting my new C-sharp DLLs because I was not coming here and clicking refresh. So the moral of the story is any of your resources that you change, if you change them you have to come here and say modify and then refresh and then reselect the DLL from the disk. And you'll have a lot better success then when you migrate it to your production system.